Hi there. This is going to be a very quick video and it's only going to be of interest to wood turners. I'm pretty sure. Anyway, let me explain what I did. I took a piece of Mayday about 10 inches long and put it on a six inch faceplate, centered it as well as I could and put it on the lathe. And when I looked at it, I thought, first of all, this is going to take forever to turn this thing round. And in the second place, the ends were both cracked and split very badly. So I decided I'll take it off. I'll put it on a circle cutting jig on my band saw and cut it round. And then I realized, being the lazy guy that I am, I didn't want to take it off the face plate. I thought there must be a way to put that on a circle cutting jig and cut it on the bandsaw. So this is what I came up with. This is my jig. Now, this is a 1 and 13 16 inch hole cut at center from the edge 3 inches. Then I took the face plate, set it in there, measured from the edge of this board to the narrowest point on that blank. So let me give you a look at what I did from there. The distance from the edge of the board to the closest point on this blank was an inch and five eighths. So I've set this at just over that amount. Now I'll set this in here. Well, this is what I ended up with. It worked really well. I'm very pleased with it. Here's the ring from it. And as I said, it was split up pretty badly on the ends. This one fell apart in no time. This one's got a lot of checking and cracking in it. So I hope this is of some use to you. I've never seen anybody do it before. I'm sure someone out there must have. I can't, I've never had an original thought for a long time, I'm sure. But if you like this, I hope you'll make use of it. And if you know someone who it might help, please feel free to share it with them. If you like this, I hope you'll click the like button. If you didn't, click the dislike button. Now don't forget to subscribe. I hope you'll come back next time. Have a great day in your shop and be safe. Take care now. Bye-bye.